Okay, so today Tess and I are going to visit Galaxy's Edge because we're missing it. And our two favorite drinks that we got at Otis Cantina, mm -hmm. and which one is it you're making? Fuzzy Tauntaun. Fuzzy Tauntaun. She went nuts over that Amazing. one. Amazing. And it has like a foamy mm -hmm. stuff that numbs mm -hmm. your mouth, which mm -hmm. I haven't tried, so we're going to be, mm -hmm. it's gonna be interesting. And she's actually making it. And she can link that video of Otis oh, Cantina yeah. <laughs> down below so you can watch it. That was fun. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to make the Outer Rim. Now, our recipes aren't going to be exact because Disney doesn't give you exact measurements. Sometimes you can't find the actual ingredients. Some of the things they had on there, like we looked back on the menu that we had and read the things off of them because they could tell you like, this is in it, this is in it, this is in it. But we couldn't find exactly some of those things. So we're doing our best and we're going to see how it tastes. Insert our own version of things. <laughs> Do the foam fart. <laughs> Yes, blooper reel. I want to do the foam part. No, that's Jeff. Jeff's not here. We can't do foam part. Okay. Speaking foam part. take two. Do you want to do the foam part first? Yes. First. Make the foam. So there were two different ways that they said that we could use it. That we could use uh, this xanthan gum, or we could use meringue powder. Use the immersion blender on. The other one says that you need to buy an aquarium. Uh, aqua aquarium. An aquarium? aquarium? I can speak today. <laughs> aquarium pump. What? To make the foam bubbles. What? Things I didn't know happened in the culinary world. Did you see? We're wearing our oh, matching yeah. ears. Okay, we'll we'll get get it. Turn it yeah. Right. I saw hers were so much better when I made hers because I made hers after I made my first one, so I have redone mine. Yeah, I'll do They were, they were like, pretty big. I got the buzz buttons. They're in here. Yep, it's a half a cup of just plain regular vodka. And now we have a buzz button tincture. A lot of people compare it to when you put that 9 volt battery in your tongue. No! So I don't know if I like that. <laughs> I got the buzz buttons from an Amazon site. It's this Florida uh, little farm. Uh, so to make the foam, we added 1.5 cups of cold water to an 8x8 square glass baking dish. Okay. A square baking dish. A square baking dish. This is really interesting. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Banna. <laughs> those lighting. Those are awesome. There's one. So while whisking constantly, we added one quarter cup of the Buzz Button Tincture Strain Tincture. So right, that, that's clear. what the little Buzz Buttons look like after right four days. So I'll zoom in on that. Right here. They look kind of funny. The, whenever they come out of the package, they have a real bright yellow oh, ring okay. on it. So. so that's probably where all of this color came from. Yeah. Let's do okay. this, and this, and this, and more of these. And then we're going to make this. <laughs> So a quarter cup. Oh jeez. Okay. Ooh. So two teaspoons of the meringue powder. Ooh, it smells weird. <laughs> So we have three quarters of a cup of the orange juice. It says uh, orange juice with tangerine, but it was impossible to find. Is it buzzing you? <laughs> it does taste like when you put it around your yeah. tongue. <laughs> I took a drink of water and it's actually worse now. Oh wow! <laughs> that was a very tiny little bit too. I I am so excited because I love this so much sitting there in the cantina. Yeah, I was yeah. super excited about recreating this. We found the actual recipe for it. Was like, yes. she, she found it. This is this is all Tessa finding this stuff. But okay, so how much of this is peach so vodka? So three, yes, three, three tablespoons of the peach vodka. It, it says, says Ciroc, but. It's peach vodka. Yeah. Uh, three tablespoons of pure cane. It says Monin, but it oh, have any colors or any bad stuff in it? I love this one. Well, Good that, job. That was. Just, I, can I take credit for it, even though I didn't do it on purpose? Yes. Because <laughs> open. Oh, <laughs> okay. Get all like Kylo Ren rage. Ah! 
I would pay someone 20 bucks to just drink this. Not, not taste it, drink it. Oh, I know, I wanna taste it first. Would you like the foam no. <laughs> Oh, you want to straight up? It takes a minute. No, it, it doesn't. No, it does not take a minute. Ooh, that's fun. Uh -huh. <laughs> e How's your tongue doing? It's still, like. Still buzzing off? Yeah, buzz is a good word because tingling is not a good description. No, it it's not tingling. It's 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 almost it's like yeah. I'm trying to describe it. Or you know mm -hmm. when you burn your tongue when it's too hot, but not painful. Like it's that. Weird. Oh yeah. Feels so official. But I was like, that's professional. It's so professional. I'm gonna go like to like. <laughs> not, ah! Yeah, there. <laughs> You gotta serve it with crushed ice because that's how they had it in August Cantina. Oh, okay. It was very, very crushed ice. Okay, that's perfect. Yes. See this color from the back. It looks exactly like the August Cantina one, and I'm so stupid. Right. Right. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Mhm. Mm I'm excited. Jackpot. <laughs> oh my god. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that tastes just like it's it. It's exactly the same. There it goes. Oh my gosh! That's funny. I am so happy. Oklahoma! Yeah. Yeah. Stormtroopers. Stormtroopers. <laughs> Stormtroopers. We're gonna move on to the outer rim. I'm a little concerned about this one because there's not an actual recipe. Oh, that's right. There's no measurements. Yes. There's no, this is how you do it. There's only the ingredients that we found on the actual menu. to find. So it was supposed to be Patron Silver Tequila. That one was easy to find, but yeah. mercy it's expensive. Oh yeah, no. <laughs> I was like, I don't even drink tequila art very often. So I got the El Padrino. It's like 15 bucks for this one. <laughs> it's still made with blue agave and it's tequila is silver. So oh, good. This is, it should be the same. It's supposed to be this Sedilla. Is it acai or acai? I say acai. Actually, I don't pronounce it at all. I just read it, but it's the A C I, I feel like it's pronounced acai, but acai. I'm probably wrong. So. I, I, do, I don't know. Supposed to be that liqueur. So I went to Total <laughs> Wine. They they didn't have it. They're like, we're not even able to get it. We're not licensed. Yeah, yet. they have to have and the agreements with the specific dealers. And so they so. looked up all the other liqueur stores in the liquor stores in Houston and mm -hmm. even specs and everything. Yeah, you can't get it here. I did the best next thing I could find. This is Razzmatazz with raspberry liqueur because to me those two those two taste very similar. Very tart, very, very like really rich. The outer rim drink has black salt on the rim. Cool, right? Right. This is what it looks like. That's not what mine's gonna look like. <laughs> because I couldn't find black salt anywhere. So I did go to the bulk section. section. I'll, get, I'll get this. <laughs> I'm rubbing off of here. This is my buzz button. They I don't have an excuse. <laughs> I can't feel my lip. I did find some black salt. I was like, yay, black salt, black salt. So I put it in my little bulk bag, got it home, and then I realized that it is smoky black salt. Oh, whoa. Oh, it whoa. smells amazing though, but not for a drink. Right? Oh, it smells like amazing beef jerky. I, right? The reason I know her is because I used to work at Pet Resort yeah. and her little baby Cora. So Cora would sit in my lap and Jana would come in and we talk and became best friends and sisters and all that kind of stuff. And whenever I was checking dogs in that were staying in the boarding area and they would have treats for them, if I saw that they had like the little pepperoni ones, that bag was open and it was over my nose for about two minutes. I'm like, those things smell so, so good. good. I'm, I'm not thinking I'm even gonna measure. I think I'm just gonna <laughs> I, it's not like I'm against doing four or five different tries on this. Right? Let's just keep trying. This is, so cool. this is try number seven. Yeah. This is tequila. We're really not that bad. We're just kidding. Okay. So let's go one, two, three, four, five. That sounds about right, right? I don't know. We're going to use the counting method. It's going to count. I say I kite raspberry liquor. I see. One, two, three. That looks about right. Lime juice. I get the liquid organic lime juice. I love this stuff. So uh, I'm gonna go with that. Well, no, it's it's supposed to be a margarita. So I'm just kind of you know. Bader. What the fuck? This is cane sugar. I'm I'm not sure if it's gonna dissolve in here. I'm kind of hoping it will. 
And again, I don't know how much, so I'm assuming it's a margarita. You want it to be not too sweet, not too tart, so that should be. And it said like actual pure cane pure sugar, cane sugar, not the syrup. <gasps> I had the ice trays that would make like X wings and oh, I oh, failed. Good. I'm using pink Himalayan sea salt because I figured that would work <laughs> in lieu of the black salt ice. Oh, things are going to fly. <laughs> Yay! Chicken like a polar bear. Yeah. Oh no. See, I'm doing this wrong. Oh, I, no. just, I don't like this thing. Oh, no. I don't like it. Did you like pat it down? Yeah, yeah. No. Yes. You patted that like you patted Ayana when she was born. <laughs> Alright. Try number one. There it is. See how it is. Wait, you're pure. Oh, fudge nugget. Oh, yeah, you're like, your favorite part. That is my favorite part. <laughs> That was the part that made you go insane in yes, Cantina. It is. It's the puree part. Mango puree. So I didn't show me making this because I didn't want to bore you, but um, <laughs> that's the mango puree. I did mangoes, like frozen mangoes, and a little orange juice because, you know, I can't just do straight mangoes. It'll be mm -hmm. too thick. I think this is right. So I tasted it and it tasted pretty darn good. <laughs> oh no, it like sunk in there. Okay, now the mango puree is in there. All right, here we go. Let's get that side. Wow, tequila! <laughs> Take it up on the raspberry? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Tell you what though, the black salt makes it. Really? And that and the mango, I mean, yeah. That's kind of, kind of sad. Uh, also, I don't think I put enough lime juice in it. So. Oh, there it is! Got it? Mm hmm. Yay! No, we're leaving enough lime juice. Oh, okay. Because it's a margarita. Yeah. Ooh. 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 And we'll be right back. We're gonna change. Yeah. One light side thing that I am. Because it's R2. I was about to say. Well, I mean, you gotta love R2. Even dark side people love R2. He's just snarky. It's true. <laughs> A little railroad. A little railroad. And the right here. Like the Superman thing. Dun, <coughs> dun, 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 dun. I can't see anymore. Copyrights. Hi, Bell. Hi, Bell. Oh no, and we we. Oh no, we we. Oh my gosh, this is so good. <laughs> the only slight difference I can tell is the raspberry, but it's not heavily a difference. It's mm -hmm. just a slight difference. I'm mm -hmm. so, so happy. <laughs> <laughs> Feel like I'm back in Galaxy's Edge. Aren't you a little short to be a stormtrooper? Success, sister time, mm -hmm. Galaxy's Edge drinks. It's Star Wars. <laughs> Tequila. <laughs> you know, nothing compares to being there and having the, the drink drinks, but having this Rex, makes me happy. Having Rex DJ for us. Yeah. Thanks for joining us. Remember, set and stops make the best adventures, and um, trying to make your own drinks to copy Disney drinks makes a really grand adventure. At least a happy one. Hey. Okay. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. This is good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm.